In this video, we're going to learn how to create word art. So the first step in creating word art is go up to the toolbar and click insert, then go down to where you find word art. When you click on that, a white box will appear. This is where you type your word. So make sure that you click in that box and type a word that's special to you. I'm going to choose the word love. After you type your word, click enter for your word art to appear on the screen. Now you have a word that you can create into art. This word can now be changed like as if it was an image. So you don't have to change the font in the same way that you did before when it comes to size. You can use the handles to make it whatever size you'd like. You can also go up and change the font name like we had before. And I like this font right here. So I'm gonna click on this one and move it to where I would like. Now, I'm gonna change what's called the fill color. The fill color is up on the toolbar and it looks like a paint can that's spilling over. When I click on that, I see all the colors like I did before, but at this top, I also see what says solid and I see something that says gradient. Gradient allows you to choose multiple colors that fade into one another like an ombre. I'm gonna choose gradient to show you all the cool things it can do. Now, there are all different gradient effects that are offered here. I'm gonna choose custom to choose the colors that I want in my gradient design. So in your custom gradient, there's first, you have to choose the type of gradient you want. You can have a linear gradient, like a line, or a radial gradient, like it comes out from the center, like a circle. I'm gonna do linear. You can then choose the angle if you'd like to change that, but I'm just gonna keep it at 90. Now, here's the fun part where you get to add your gradient stops. So you can add colors or remove colors. I'm going to add the color and the place where you add is a circle that's in blue that's selected. Add the color red to the beginning. Then I'm going to change the middle color. I'm going to add another color to this. And I'm going to add the color yellow. And I'm gonna add a third color. You can add as many colors as you want, but right now I'm just gonna do three. One in the beginning, middle, and the end. I move my color all the way down to the end and choose the color blue. Now I have the colors red, yellow, and blue fading into one another. Now when I click okay, it will put that effect onto my word. And now here is my gradient word art. So you can design words however you want using different fill colors, using different border colors, anything that you want to create your word art however you want. Have fun creating word art. 